my old nightstand. Mother said they threw it away. There's a matchbox inside the drawer. Try to light up the room. Hey, where are you? Mother, I'm in the basement. The boss said you'll get a seat in that place. Get out immediately. I'm still waiting to hear the prayer, son. What are you waiting for? You put in there? Why would you do that, Yoda? It's his behavior that did that to me. It was good all day. Mother has dozens of the same in her room. Each has an engraving with a big scary eye inside a triangle. <laughs> help! Mother! Help me! I'm sorry. I, I thought you were that witch. <laughs> How many times do I have to tell you? Witches don't exist. And it's just the two of us here. You're wrong. Father would never lie to us. About what now? About the witch that cursed our bloodline. He's just trying to scare us with stories so we don't do anything wrong. And today you did wrong, so we punished you by locking you down here in the dark. What did I do? I, I still don't understand. You talked to that tall boy. Don't you remember? We are not allowed to talk to other people anymore. They are evil. I thought that meant we must avoid adults. How am I supposed to make friends then? Mother said we have each other and God. She's right. I don't think we need anyone else. Why are you here? I heard Father talking to himself before going to get you in your room. So I ran here and hid. But why? You know he's going to be very angry at you once he finds out. Because I've promised I wouldn't let you be alone in the dark again. And when I promise something... You never break a promise, I know. I'm glad you were here. I can't forget our aunt's white face. Me neither. She looked so different. Her head was so bloated and pallid. And her eyes and hair, so dark. The curse did that to her. Don't be ridiculous. She's at peace now. That's all that matters. I hope she is. Your aunt was once such a beautiful woman, full of life, a perfect creation of God. But her fate was nothing more than a Sunday morning rite, and the witch's curse just a fairy tale story. Evil is everywhere, my dear children. It is hiding in the shadows of this world. It takes form of animals, and it possesses people. Father, please forgive- You should look up to your sister. 
Unlike you, she values God and this family. It's my fault he went to talk to that boy. I ignored him because I was looking into the coffin and I lost sense of time. Ah, I beg you, don't hurt him anymore. You must learn to be alone with God. You must learn. You all must learn what true faith is. Oh, I often think about that peculiar day, but I've never relived it so vividly in my dreams. Why now? Why in this place? I... I need my glasses. I can't even think without them. The fabric is full of moth-eaten holes. Though too small for my glasses to have fallen through. Ah, here they are. Fallen to the floor, but still intact. Thinking of the dream I had, I don't remember going to sleep at all. We came in, and then... We came in, Victoria and Nikolai went upstairs to prepare for the castle, and then... Nothing. I must have fainted. I have to talk to Victoria at once. locked. Victoria or Nikolai must have found the key and locked it while I was asleep. A cold black fireplace that hasn't been used in ages. The same feeling I'm getting from the rest of the house.
All I see here is a lonely coat rack. Nikolai? Yes, Benedict? Where's Victoria? I don't know. Do you have the key to the house? The door appears to be locked. I don't know where the key is. Do you have the slightest idea why Victoria rented this dreary house? I don't even know how she found it. Looks like the owner is some kind of artist. Or is at least convinced to be. Very morbid taste. Strange figures. I agree. I've never seen so many masks in my life. Especially not placed on walls. That's a strange painting. It is. Take a better look at it and tell me what you see. Why? Please, do as I say. I'll get to the point. Please, don't. I tried opening them, but the light was just too strong for my eyes. If we don't find a civilized way to get out of here soon, this rack could come in handy to do it by force. A giant bowl made out of clay, filled with what seems to be some type of oil. A yellow blanket, wrinkled only on one side of the bed. A yellow blanket, wrinkled only on one side of the bed. Where's Victoria? I don't know. 